Hello there and welcome. Do you find typing using the mobile phone keyboard a bit of a handicap to your work? I've made this video to help those who find using the mobile phone keyboard a bit of a handicap in their work. Personally, I like to connect a standard keyboard to my mobile phone so that I can do what you refer to as touch typing. That is typing using all the fingers. You agree with me that the keyboard that is found on the mobile phone does not allow you to use all the fingers. And the touch typing actually is, is for those who want to type stuff with a lot of speed. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I connect the mobile phone to the keyboard so that I can use that keyboard to enter data into the mobile phone. In order to do this, you need a cable which we refer to as an OTG cable. The OTG cable has got one side which has got a USB socket. The other uh, plug is the same as the, the one that you use on the data cable of your mobile phone. So once you have ensured that that is the case, you just need to plug in this end into the mobile phone. Like that. And then the other end, you plug in the USB from of your keyboard because your keyboard has got a USB. So you plug it in here. If you have a wireless keyboard, because sometimes you may be lucky to have a wireless keyboard, all you need to do is do the connections via this USB plug. But for now, I have a wired keyboard. So I just need to plug in like that. And it is connected. Now, I also want to use the mouse to control the details on the screen of my mobile phone. Now, how do I do that? In order to do that, I will need what we refer to as a USB hub. The USB hub has got just one cable, which you can connect to uh, the computer. And then it's got several sockets for you to connect various uh, devices via using the USB. So a USB hub like this one comes in very handy. So what I'll do, I'll get this data cable from, from the USB hub and connect it to the OTG cable. Here. You get your USB hub, connect it to the OTG cable, and then the OTG cable is connected to your mobile phone. Now using one of the USB sockets, I can plug in the USB from my, my keyboard. And then, because my mouse is wireless, I'm going to put in this dongle here in, in the other USB socket. There. And now using that, let me just put it away so that now I, you can be able to see what is happening. You can see even... As soon as I, I disturb the, the, the USB, uh, the mobile phone actually detects that. And now I can be able to scroll just using the, the mouse. You can see, scrolling now through the various icons and uh, I can select any of the icons. Uh, like for example, I can select this one let me put it in a good position so that you can be able to see what's happening. I can select this icon here. Maybe let's assume I want to put in data, for example. Let's assume I want to put in data here. Let me erase that. And you can see I'm using the, the, um, the keyboard to do that. So I can go ahead and now do the normal typing. And let's assume I want to enter this data. And you can see it's quite fast, quite fast. So remember, all you need is that, that OTG cable. And additionally, if you want, you can also get this USB hub it allows you to connect many devices. Like you can see, I've seen, I've got two extra USB sockets where I can connect even another flash disk 
maybe I can connect a flash disk here and I'll be able to access this flash disk on my mobile phone. So that one is a short video of showing you how you can connect the keyboard to your mobile phone allowing you to do what we call touch typing. So that's it in this video where we were able to see how we can use this OTG cable to connect our keyboard to the mobile phone.